Hello everyone, this is your German teacher Erhan Özdemir from Istanbul, Turkey. In this lesson, we are going to have the verb möchten. Möchten stands for want or would like to. Okay? It is just like a modal verb. The function is just like a modal verb, but we don't uh, call this as modal verb. First, we are going to conjugate this and then we are going to have this in uh, examples. Ich möchte, which stands for I want, I would like to. Du möchtest, you would like to, you want to. Er möchte, he wants. Sie möchte, she wants. Es möchte, this refers to uh, all the other articles. Der für er, die für sie, das für es. Okay? So, if I want, I'll say, ich möchte. If I say, you want, We'll say, du möchtest, he wants, er möchte, she wants, sie möchte, it wants, es möchte. If I mention, if I mention, we want, we will say, wir möchten, you want, this would be for two or more people, a group of people, this would be then, ihr möchtet, sie, here we have the you form, which is actually the formal way of saying you and it's written with a capital and Z which stands for they. This refers to möchten. So if I say we want, wir möchten, you want, group of people, ihr möchtet, sie möchten for you, the, in for, uh, the formal way of saying you and sie möchten for saying they want, sie möchten. If this was too fast for you, I want you to repeat after me, please. Ich möchte. Ich möchte. Du möchtest. Du möchtest. Er möchte. Er möchte. Sie möchte. Sie möchte. Es möchte. Es möchte. Wir möchten. Wir möchten. Ihr möchtet, ihr möchtet, sie möchten, sie möchten. As we did the conjugation of möchten, I want to have these in following sentences. First of all, we are going to have a general sentence, but then after we will have the variation of möchten. Let's get started. If I say, I eat the bread, I will say, Ich esse das Brot. Das Brot stands for bread. Essen for eat. I eat or I am eating bread. I will say ich esse das Brot. I eat the bread. Ich esse das Brot. If I say I want to eat the bread, I will say ich möchte, as here, we conjugated it as ich möchte. So this will be in the second position. Ich möchte das Essen, uh, excuse me, ich möchte das Brot essen. So as you see, we have this esse as here conjugated, but here in the infinitive form. So what is conjugated? The modal verb, right? So I conjugate the modal verb. Or let's say möchten is uh, just like a modal verb. We don't call this as a modal verb, but it is just like a modal verb conjugated, okay, uh, as a role in the sentence. So if I have this essen, I need to have this in the end of the sentence. The conjugation will take here in the second place. So I say, I want to eat bread. Ich möchte das Brot essen. So if there is an article in the sentence, there is a specific meaning. I want to eat that bread, okay? So, ich möchte das Brot essen in the infinitive form, in the ending, okay? In the next example we have, du trinkst das Wasser. You drink the water. You drink, du trinkst das Wasser. The conjugation here, trinken, is as du trinkst, right? So if I want to put this with a möchten verb, what do I do? I conjugate möchten, 
do möchtest, as du möchtest, and put it here to the second position. Du möchtest das Wasser, and the infinitive of this is what? Trinken, right? So, in the ending will be trinken. So, I'll say, du möchtest das Wasser trinken. You want to drink the water. So, instead of saying, du trinkst das Wasser, I will put möchten, and I'll say, du möchtest das Wasser trinken. In the next example, we have, sie geht in die Universität. I think that this is obvious, right? In die Universität stands for to the university. Gehen stands for going. She goes to the university. Okay, that's a female person. Sie geht in die Universität. She goes to the university. So, what do I do if I say she wants to go to the university? As we see here in the chart, this is the third singular form. So, we need to look here. And this is conjugated as sie möchte, right? Sie möchte. Here we have möchte in the second position. And gehen, the infinitive of gehen, right? Geht. Infinitive and in the ending, gehen. So I'll say she wants to go to the university and this is sie möchte in die Universität gehen. She wants to go to the university. Sie möchte in die Universität gehen. If this was too fast for you, I want you to repeat after me, please. Ich esse das Brot. Ich esse das Brot. Ich möchte das Brot essen. Ich möchte das Brot essen. Du trinkst das Wasser. Du trinkst das Wasser. Du möchtest das Wasser trinken. Du möchtest das Wasser trinken. Sie geht in die Universität. Sie geht in die Universität. Sie möchte in die Universität gehen. Sie möchte in die Universität gehen. Let's continue with the following examples. Wir spielen Tennis. We are playing or we play Tennis. Wir spielen Tennis. So, if I say we want to play Tennis, the conjugation will be möchten, just like in the infinitive form. So, we are going to say wir möchten Tennis spielen yeah, it remains the same. So, I'll say, wir möchten Tennis spielen. We want to play Tennis. And here it says, wir spielen Tennis. We play Tennis. But here, as I said before, we'll take in the second position. So, this will be as, wir möchten Tennis spielen. In the next example, there is a negative form. It says, ihr schwimmt nicht. Schwimmen to swim, you do not swim, you don't swim. So, ihr schwimmt nicht. There is a negative form. Schwimmt will be as infinitive as we have möchten. So, möchten will be conjugated as ihr möchtet in the second plural form. Excuse me. Yeah, the second plural form, right? So, I will say ihr möchtet nicht schwimmen, as you see, nicht takes here place after the modal verb and therefore, ihr möchtet nicht schwimmen, you don't want to swim, the infinitive form, the verb will stay always in the ending, just like in the modal verbs, okay? So in the next sentence, it says, sie trinken Kaffee. Sie trinken Kaffee, you drink coffee. Sie, it could be either the formal way of saying you or they. It depends on what I mean. So I need to look at the previous sentence for the meaning. What do I understand of sie? Because as I have one sentence of saying sie trinken Kaffee, it could be either the you form or the what form? It could be they form. But don't mix this with Z. This is something else. This stands for she. Okay? And is conjugated 
as different. Here it says Sie möchte, but here it says Sie möchten. This is very important, okay? So, as I say, Sie trinken Kaffee, you drink coffee. I would say, you want to drink coffee, trinken here remains the same, it will be in the infinitive form. So, here it is conjugated as möchten, it remains the same. So, I'll say then, Sie möchten Kaffee trinken, you want to drink coffee. Or this could be also, they want to drink coffee, okay, according to the meaning. So, if this was too fast for you, I want you to repeat after me, please. Wir spielen Tennis. Wir spielen Tennis. Wir möchten Tennis spielen. Wir möchten Tennis spielen. Ihr schwimmt nicht. Ihr schwimmt nicht. Ihr möchtet nicht schwimmen. Ihr möchtet nicht schwimmen. Sie trinken Kaffee. Sie trinken Kaffee. Sie möchten Kaffee trinken. Sie möchten Kaffee trinken. In this lesson we will learn the verb möchten. We conjugated möchten and had this in different examples. I hope you enjoyed it. I want you to subscribe to our channel, leave comments, share this video with those who want to learn the German language and hit the bell button for further more videos. I hope to see you again. Till then, tschüss!